So this is the whole mission and this is the scan. And here we are going in closer to where the scans were taken. And so this is one of the main hallways outside. As you can see, it picks up all sorts of details such as things outside and inside as well. So you can take scans within the rooms and then enter them on the actual computer once you've stitched together all of the renderings. Now it's stuck. So here's the whole courtyard. And then you can enter into built into rooms. Such as this looks like some sort of prayer room. And how many hours, how many people would you say we're looking at right now? Um, well, the actual scanning itself took about a team of 10 or so. And so, and they went and spent an entire day taking all the actual scans. And so that's going from room to room. And then to stitch it together and to create the actual file, such as this, takes a couple, couple more days, if not weeks, to actually put it all together. But we had one one girl working on this, and she was able to do all of this within two weeks. Anything you want to show that you think is really cool? Um, I mean, it's all really cool. I mean, the best is when you can actually zoom in on people, because you can see like their features and everything. But because of these ones, people are actually moving. So you just get like slivers of people. Oh, See, like those are people right there. See? <laughs> but because they are moving, it only picks up pieces. But it's really incredible if someone stands, sits still, then you can get like a whole, whole face to them. And what's been your work on this part of the project? Um, I wrote the manual for how to use the scanner. So we ha it's actually pretty complex. So I wrote the manual. And that's the scanner right yeah, the over there. Yeah, it's right over there in the manual. It's right in front of me. Well, thank you. Thank you. See ya.